take this information or don't take it apply it in your life or choose not to use it or don't use it it is totally up to you but i am here to let you know that this is meant to reduce your stress and anxiety levels okay whether you know the information came across it read about it and stuff like that but i feel like if you hear it again it will definitely liberate you in the book of philippians why is this <laughs> why is this one acting up? okay we temper this one is testing me hold on we're good to go in the book of philippians 4 verse 6 and 7 it reads as follows it says do not no it doesn't say that there's your eta. <laughs> it says it don't don't worry about anything instead pray about everything tell god what you need and thank him for all he has done then you will experience god's peace which exceeds anything we can understand his peace will guard your heart hearts his peace will guard your hearts and minds as you live in christ jesus yeah we have to be mindful of adding words that come out of our minds into the scripture wrong false wrong i had um <laughs> i was recently made also aware <laughs> of the scripture that we usually you know like a lot of people like we like nine and quarter lap okay we used to okay and that is the truth and nothing but the truth so happy god <laughs> i had in a radio broadcast <laughs> this guy was saying um vumelani abantwana beze gimi nguguba umbusa wali zulu ungo wabo eh it doesn't say that the scripture doesn't say that <laughs> no false <laughs> i know we grew up and people have been like, like putting it like that it's it no it doesn't say that hello <laughs> hello guys welcome back to this is what i do my name if you are new here my name is zanele malandule but you can call me rich auntie we are currently sitting on 680 subscribers and going towards 5,000. <laughs> we're dreaming big why on earth not okay why not <laughs> why not <laughs> why not so if you haven't subscribed please do support by adding your subscriptions into this channel i Solely depend on it for my growth for growing this channel and give it a like if you like this video otherwise thank you so much for joining this family we have a scripture here written um, in the book, book of Philippians 4 6 and 7 going into 2024 we need these things because there's a lot of stress that we allowed ourselves to endure even though you know we shouldn't have you know it comes to a point whereby if we take these kind of knowledges this kind of scriptures we write it plug it out everywhere in our houses as a reminder we need to have the minds of children that great word when they teach these kids they they will teach one thing maybe for an entire week like in some sort of a song until it gets into their minds so that it's not easy for them to forget for, to forget okay so we have to have these kind of scriptures written everywhere you know as a reminder because we also are faced with a lot so it's easy for us to complain in areas that we shouldn't because we left the scripture that says do not worry about anything instead pray about anything and everything i have just added which is wrong there's a lot of anxiety that we have allowed ourselves to enjoy or partake in and stress, you know, a lot of talks, negativity and everything that we, we allowed ourselves, you know, but looking at it now, if we had, you know, yo guys, you will see my stuff here. If we had just simply applied the scripture every day, apply the scripture, do not worry, don't worry about anything instead pray about anything and everything instead pray pray about everything ungawari ungakatsetegi ngalutho kulega ngako i feel like singahle nje we could be able to dodge some of the traps that 
the devil has put for us out there you know i feel like this is where the saying that says knowledge is power i feel like this is where this enters take it don't take it use it or don't use it apply it in your life choose whatever but i feel like i personally feel like i felt in the beginning of this video <laughs> this might help see you in my next video bye